becoming more of you. We thank you. We give you praise. We trust you. Please. We thank you because you have been good to us. You have been good to our children. Lord, you have been good to this. You have been good to parents. Eternal God, we lift up your name. We worship you. We ask that you receive our praises and thanks in the name of Jesus. Lord, from Jesus 1 to this moment, you have been their anchor. Six good years. Lord, you have kept them. Lord, none of them is missing. Eternal God, we return the glory to you. We ask, Lord, that we now exalted in the name of Jesus. Lord, this program is unto you. The Bible says, why two or more people are gathered together in your name and there? This afternoon, this program will be open in the name of the Father, in the name of the Son, and in the name of the Holy Spirit. To take control of every activity in this place this afternoon. And Jesus said, Lord, Jesus said, Lord, shall be glorified. Lord, we worship you. We thank you for the real college, for helping them to help our children. Lord, we have some more that you will continue to help this school to grow in need of the in the name of Jesus. Lord, as our children are graduating today and they are taking a step forward, you will be with them. You will direct them. Lord, you will, your, your favor, your glory, your presence shall overshadow their lives in the name of Jesus. We thank you, O oh God, for bringing us to a successful ending of their second mistake. Blessed be your name. Lord, we exalt you. We give you grace. For we are praying with thanksgiving in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you, God. 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 Thank you,
Right now, I'd like to invite to the podium the principal of the Bell College, Mr. Akomi, for the introduction of the graduation students. The round of applause for you, please. Thank you very much. Good afternoon, my parents, our graduates. I'm very proud to be to thank our parents for your support. Especially the big set. It's a unique set. Uh, it's a strong set. Uh, like my grandfather said, the only set of uh, three day exam we are in mass. That's why it's not. And the only set that will spend almost four or five months waiting for a exam day that's continuing shipping every week. Uh, with the assistance of God and the ICBT, and of course, the discipline of the sex, they were in class. We were not looking for them. They didn't allow the classroom, uh, the home situation to start them. We thank them for their strength. They are strong. The tough time is going to an end, but the tough girls and the boys are here with us. I thank God for your life. Uh, my teacher, uh, and then again, I think uh, this class, uh, they are unique. It is their time that we started the program for the first For many of them, they are starting for the first time. But before they finish, they were able to make machine and robot that they gave on training to a generation of engineers and So I thank God for your life. And I believe that uh, they are stepping into the hard of work. They are stepping strong and they are stepping with vision and they are going to bring back a good thing for us in, in the near future. I am uh, very sure that, uh, like your officials have been, we will be very, very good to know them, then they have all over the world. I am very sure they are going to do something stronger than even than them in this other country. Let me start from the whole, the whole. When I call you, you will like to know what the vision is. I have my left. Yes, it's for me, for no I want to be I think it's very bad when we start uh, for the department to attend this school. The fault, yes, the fault. So, we have a the department to the And we have one of our robotics elders, Otna Alamkin. And we have Bangola and Mati. Uh, the presentation, we know that it's first thing 
with Angela Jesu. Angela Jesu, Andrew Alao. We have Ola Lili of Mongo Yiga and Norway Gentleman supporting Ella and Sepa. Welcome to your life. For the staff and the your public support, welcome to your sponsor. God bless you, thank you. And uh, he was actually attending the long night class. He was in that point time. Not calling for the point. So thank you very much. We have our senior boy. To be a senior boy, just go. The first most first of all meet is a rapper. So they are as they are living the school, they have that of the karate and violence. So to be a pick of the school, we have that course, then followed by a hands-on learning progress. So I want to be to you, Mumbara Titi Lola, our helper. An engineering summer camp in South Africa, and the mouth of Kala is Africa, 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 Mumbara, this is your last and for that day for a day for three years. For that day for three years. Well, that's what I'm doing. Remember that our children are like their parents who are angry. Like to be very busy in school. So, thank you very much for being here. And uh, like I said, this set is unique. Very, very unique. You see, we have head girl, head boy. But because of some handwriting qualities, we plan to receive with these initiatives for easy, we are there for others. We can do things without being uh, actually prompted or cutting or minded to do it. And uh, we created, instead of senior girl, instead of head uh, girl, like senior president. And that is Jan Zonda Adenor. Jan Zonda Adenor. We thank you for your time. Thank you. We thank you very much. Uh, we have our head people. And people like that for me, maybe the Kamal very old, but I think the great year is very affecting me. The year is young to start. If I can do it, I name what I need as a name. And that is a Hura for you. And I need you for a lot for you. So you are welcome. And I have my good friend there. Of my family, for a lot to win the role.
She first uh, maybe looked over the country for a year or so, then came back. But she's in the and she's doing wonderfully well. She's doing work, especially when she was taking the high service party. She didn't let it grow, and we are expecting a very excellent result. Uh, thank you very much. Yeah. How are you? I uh, never lost my respect on fine. I never lost my So that is the tool you want to be from that day. We have to get in the other side of the country because it's important to me. It's important to me. For many of us who have been coming to this group for PTA meetings, you have seen how one of the students that are coming from regularly is a population of everything. That's a lot of things. We think of that we are not just side of paper or items at all. She went to the same school as what is your can in that particular change this year. And she won four regions in the highest region for the lost states. For the zone, for the western zone. Then she won regions for spelling B, for reading, uh, reading, as well as what? Quiz for vision. So, for course, who gathered in about 1985 students. You won four different brands. This time you the and we have here on that big thing. You will find that on our paper, on our chart. And we can for look for the uh, with our daughter. So we can go for, for your life. You see, when you work in an institution, and after leaving the place, you have seen for some years left, you see, find enough confidence in the job to thank your work. The first story in that school is a lot. So I think of your life. The other I call her our daughter. She is the daughter of one of our former staff of the school. And she is doing one of the work to character. So thank you very much. And uh, as you see, uh, Bingen is also one of the students in the school in competition, essay, debate, and so forth. And in fact, if you pencil down my guest name, and one thing happened that you will not think I gave oh, it to be so far. So she doesn't see her challenge, so we love this. Thank you very much. And I saw somebody here at that time, Sodna and Chesna. This is the start of Sodna and Chesna. I saw somebody at Sodna and Ankit. This is his sister, Atesna and Ankit. I want to thank you very much for giving us two of the pictures um, uh, things in life, the children. So yeah, I pray they are here. Mommy and dad. So please everybody has been I thank them for, for this. And I believe I said I want to go please. Thank you very much. Thank you. Please uh, we have uh and this is your brief, well please let's go. Zaina.
Christ and we thank God for all the gifts from years ago. They were the first three people from the second story. And the best for them came from and they decided. So I think I have given you this story. And uh, if you are here, the man for the previous uh, parent day, I will say she was the chief MC and the student was conducting my side. Uh, like the professional uh, communicator. So we thank you all your life. Demon is a very good. This is a very good. Thank you very much. Yes. We thank you for the life of the director of the school and, the, and our family. Thank you very much. We formally call our city, but our school name is actually Josephine. So this is Josephine City Friday. What are the colors of the school? He's not a very good speaker, very good orator. He went from sometimes to Lipsy High School for the content. And before he got to the he got to school, I think when he said to the director, this is okay, it is special. But so he spoke with all his very good eloquence and nice diction and straight to the point. So I think God bless you for projecting the image of the school. Thank you. Uh, not only we go to the students and learn, but we go to the pandemic because you have to see this as a kind of inspiration and what you will support this pandemic to allow for staff. So, and staff, and this only means that this time is very great to ensure that we don't have too many people in this hall. Thank you very much. Our chapel prefect, Tani Toluwa, and the Yeni. We have the other thing. Thank you, I'm very happy for you. So I know I'm going to work and I want to start with me. The other name I call her is Princess. So uh, as you see her, uh, very confident. That's what I'm doing with her. So she can tell you how you want you to be and this is why you should be the way you should be. And uh, without any fine struggle, she knows what she wants. And I know that in the last day, since they are very cool after the pandemic and school, I can tell you that you find her many times in the school. She always and like as the corner, being a strong blend of all. She is not just a director of the school, she is an author. She wrote and published a book which we four of us were there. So can you clap her, please? In fact, what do you call her? What do you call her? Two public photos. Some of the public, for the people of the world, two public photos. One is yesterday uh, as Debola, and the other is our Dudu, who is one of the people who are and uh, thank God for the life of the parents, the people working harder to ensure that we are able to live us above the system. Uh, by next year, by Monday, next week, that will be the third time coming to this book for the same family. Thank you for this, for the support of the Yes. <clears throat> Yes, it is very, very important. 
that we uh, because that is where the world is going. The, the next idea is to be high CTO, artificial intelligence all the way. So right from the big money, we already have a guru in the so that people have a place. Thank you very much, Dr. I think the beautiful that not here is very good now. Thank you. And then they form a different thing that talk. So, think that we see on the topic, the demonstration of created machines, robots that move, a lot of things, traffic micro, so they are there. Thank you very much. Where is your friend? So, thank you very much. So, uh, please, uh, on behalf of the school uh, director, there are for life of the school, I have to thank you. This tech year set, uh, 31st of the Green College Run. I have a present to them. Thank you very much for this. To say something, to take the welcome message is the director of the Bill College Institution, Ebola, the great woman. A wonderful mother, the fantastic young man, and a wonderful teacher. I see her as she simple but beautiful, inside and out. Please let's stand up and give her another round of applause. I welcome you to the graduation of the class of 2020 of the Great College. Today is a historic day in the lives of this class of 2020, the 21st set of the Veil College alumni. First and foremost, we give all the glory and honor to God, our Savior, Jesus Christ, for keeping us all till today. Indeed, it is by his grace that we have not been consumed. Especially this year, that many have lost their lives and loved ones to the global pandemic of COVID-19. We do not take his grace and mercies for granted. Blessed be his holy name. Hallelujah. I congratulate the parents of the class of 2020 can all the parents of the class of 2020 please stand up and the sponsor, Mr. Ashmoli, please stand up. Please, you can clap for your Everybody. 
for the way in which you have worked diligently and your devotion to duty together with your sacrifice, especially since April. Thank you for your innovation and creativity demonstrated during the online classes, the robotics and artificial intelligence classes, Mr. Shodeke, Mr. Sonko, that we thank you very much. We really appreciate you very much. I also want to thank the class teacher of this particular set, Mr. Dyson.
You are indeed a very outstanding set of looking young men and ladies. Mr. Debola. Ladies, I'm very proud of you all. Sound character, well behaved, cultured, and intelligent youths who are undoubtedly are destined for the top by God's grace. This year also, the first set of Bona Ike's followers, Bona Jumoka Ike, And I'm 
saying today that all alumni, this graduating set of CBC alumni, will be eligible to a 10% tuition discount at the Bill Tutorial College. I entrust you and your bright future to the loving hands of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, who is more than able to keep us from falling and who will keep us all safely in the hollow of his hands, in Jesus' name. So I say to you, go forth in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, and you will shine to the glory of God and the benefit of mankind. And we look forward to hearing good news of your exploits in university and later on in your chosen careers. Many of you will come back to address the current and future students. Many will return to collect awards at our 30th anniversary, our 35th, our 45th, our 50th anniversaries. And I pray that the Lord will touch you to give back to the school that we will love. So I won't be saying goodbye, but instead I will say a bientôt, which in French means see you soon. God keep you safely until we meet again at home and abroad. I love you all very much and will miss you all. Congratulations to the class of 2020. Go forth and shine to God's glory. Based on Psalm 18, 32, 33, 
is that God will arm you with strength. God will make your way clear. God will make you as sure-footed as a deer. And God will enable you to stand on mountain heights. God will train your hands for battle. And you will train your arms to bend bows of bronze. Now, what I want you to take away from this psalm is having sure-footed, being sure-footed as a deer. This, see, the deer, this particular deer is a special species. It climbs steep hills, mountains, like no other animal can. Any animal that attempts to follow the deer up the mountain will fall over. But it's because of the way God has created the feet of the deer and the instinct that God has given this deer. Now, when an animal is climbing, it climbs with four feet. When this deer is climbing, it climbs with two feet. Because the, two, the four feet are in complete correlation with the two back feet. So the very spot the four feet land will be the spot the back, the hind feet will land. Any small hinge on the mountain provides sufficient landing spot for the deer. And that's what the Bible says for us to be as sure footed as a deer. When the back feet are in correlation with the front feet, that talks of integrity. That there is a seamlessness in what your heart desires and what your actions portend. So as you move out of Vail College, I pray that God will give you grace to be authentic. You have to be who God has made you. Don't be a photocopy. Don't cut and paste. Don't copy and paste. You have to be who you are. The best place for the deer is the mountain top. If the deer falls into the river, it can survive with the instincts because what the feet are rooted for are scraggy terrain. Not water terrain, not smooth land. And there are some times the deer gets taken away from the mountain and is brought into the city. After a while in the city, the deer begins to lose the instinct of climbing. So if you now take the deer back onto the mountain for the first few months, the front, the back feet will not will not align perfectly with the four with the four feet. And what that means is, as you move out of here, there will be some dreams in your heart. But you have to allow God to preserve those dreams. Don't let your dreams get polluted to the point where there is no alignment in your heart. So my check to you, graduating class of 2020, is have courage, pray for courage that you might be who God has created you to be. And as you go in life, this class is special. We've not had the ceremony in the way we're having it. But it's not a bad thing, it's because we are special. Now, you have to understand that none of us planned for what we have. But whether we do well in the crisis or not depends on preparation. So as you're moving out, prepare for life. You cannot, plan. you cannot plan for everything in life. But when you are prepared for life, it becomes much easier. I have a picture, to I have three pictures to show you about preparation for life. Can I get some help? Can I get the pictures to you? About traveling. And there are some highways to some parts of the world where it is an offense to run out of gas. 
is that it fails to run out of petrol. So if you're driving and your car runs out of petrol, you get a baby fine. And that's my message for you. Don't run out of gas in life. Huh? Prepare. You don't have to plan. You plan but prepare. Because preparation makes you ready for eventualities. You plan for the things you know, and you plan for some other contingencies. But when you prepare the things you are not ready for, you are able to meet up. And there is nothing like a man who is prepared when his time comes. You don't know what the phone call is going to come and say, you are admitted, you are employed. But when you are prepared for that moment, then your dream becomes a reality. There is a point I'm going to commend to you. It's called the gate of the year. This was written a long time ago. And it's a portion of it which is the thought. And I said to the man who stood at the gate of the year, give me a light that I may tread safely into the unknown. And he replied, Go out into the darkness and put your hand in the hand of God. That shall be to you better than light and safer than a known way. So I went forth and find the hand of God. I trod gladly into the night and he led me towards the hills and towards the breaking of the day in the blown east. You are about to leave secondary school, you are walking into an unknown world. My charge to you is put your hands in the hands of God. That shall be to you better than light and safer than a known way. God knows the end from the beginning. He is all powerful, all known. So when your hands are in the hands of God, your future is assured. Your future is secure. There is nothing that, will, that has the capacity to take you out. Because the one in whose hands your hands are is greater than whatever is coming against you. You can't plan for all of life. Things happen, disappointments occur. But when your hands are in the hands of God, you are sure that at the end of the day, you will overcome because all things will work together for your good. So as you leave the Bill College, may God bless you, may God keep you, may His face shine upon you, may you perpetually dwell in the countenance of His eyes. And may, may you find favor at every turn and at every twist in life. Amen. Once again, put your hands in the hands of God and continually ensure that His grace enables you to be sure footed as a deer. And before I leave, if you take a look at that Psalm 1833, it has an equivalent in the book of Habakkuk. But what Habakkuk says is he will take you to your high mountain. So it's not just any high mountain. There is a mountain that has your name written all over it. There is a destination that has just your name for it. And that's why you have to be yourself because nobody can take your place in your destiny in God. So there is a mountain with your name Pursue your dream. There is a place that only you can occupy. And my prayer to, to God today for you is that the place He has prepared for you, that is waiting for you, you will arrive there and you will reign in that place to the glory of God. Amen. To the parents, congratulations, and the God who has helped you this far will take you all the way. And over these children, there shall be continuous joy, continuous rejoicing. Congratulations, parents and students. God bless you. Congratulations.
to be the best, number one and nothing less. Lead me to my destiny. I have waited patiently. I have vision, though I believe. I know I can count on me. So stand up for the champions, for the champions. Stand up, stand up. Stand up for the champions, for the champions. Stand up, stand up, stand up for the champions, for the champions. Stand up. Here we go. It's getting close. Now it's just who wants it most. It's just life. That's how it is. 'Cause we have our strengths and weaknesses. Oh, I have vision. Oh, can't you see? I'm on the move. Make way for me. So stand up for the champions. For the champions. Stand up. Stand up. Stand up. For the champions. For the champions. And when I fall down, I have to pick myself back up. And when I fall down, I have to pick myself back up. And when I fall down, I have to pick myself back up. And when I fall down, I have to pick myself up. Stand up. For the champions, for the champions, stand up, stand up. For the champions, for the champions, stand up, stand up, stand up. Champions for the champions stand up.
here. Just to know how well you can just the back of the future that we have with us. About getting excellent results, it's a given. Just forget it. Because last year we had 98% of our students getting B and above. This year we have hundred percent success with a student having three A stars and two other students having A star, A star. The one that has A star, mathematics, physics, and chemistry. The two people that you see in the middle here have already been admitted to university in the United Kingdom. And while it's in the university, a company is paying, is still paying his salary for him to now go back and work with the company when he finishes from the university. Now, why is our school different when our kids are not used of that very college? So whatever you get in that very college, you know you should get it there, if not more. We the school was established 10 years ago, but we moved to our home campus two years ago. And it's because these students will say they don't want to stay within the same premises that they have been for the past six years. Now we are in another campus where they have more freedom. There are some things we do that other elementary schools don't do. Number one, we have leadership training. We train our students about leadership. We have mentoring. We bring in our A-level students that have graduated to come back and give back to them. And we are able to interact with them because they belong to the same age group. We also engage them in character development. How they are going to portray themselves outside. And how they can live with their peers in the university. You know, the university is a community where there are no parents to look after them. And for a child to be somebody who has to the university, you must be well in that. That is why we stand in the gap. So that the students will be confident, they will have capacity to withstand whatever the stress will be for them at the university level. And right now, last uh, August, we had our own PAs in our campus for the first time. And one of the old students, Christiana Joel, who got an A star in sociology last year and got the best result in literature and English throughout his entire year. She got a B in literature and English last year. She found out from the other school. She was the one that addressed it. Where am I now talking to us now? I'm addressing us now. I'm addressing us because these students are excellent in performance. We've had about their job stores. What they need now is for us to put on that excellent the capacity to be able to compete with their peers in the university. And that capacity is what we provide at the Victoria College. Also, the director is also giving 25% discount to students from this school that enroll at the Victoria College. Please thank us for that one. So it's an opportunity. Uh, and that you see here left in Nigeria yesterday for the Netherlands. He has been admitted into the university there. So we can go on and go on and go on. In fact, a parent of our school had to spend his own money to book for an advert for us at the radio station in Akure. Had to go there for a live program. And the school was introduced to the people in Akure. Finally, so that we know what we are talking about. I have the permission of the parent to read out and testimony about the school. She wrote to us and she said, I can share it with the public. So please listen to what our parents wrote about the school. We would like to thank the Dabel Victoria College staff for their work. We brought our daughter to the college with an issue of academic and social personal issues, impacting on her performance, attitude to learning, social personal relationships, and sense of self. In the short time that she has, that is spent at the college, specifically just after one week of resumption. Our outlook and presentation have completely turned around, and we were astonished at the remarkable difference in our attitude to learning, communication skills, consideration of others, and orientation towards our studies. In our discussion with us, we established she has gained the new focus on our academic goals, and she spoke fondly of the teachers and their capabilities. We noted that she was adequately to provide by staff, look well in her service and hope of a reconnection to her spiritual needs, which we are sure is a measure of the school's excellence in care and pastoral support. We appreciate your work with our daughter and are appreciative of the support you have given to our daughter. 
and pray for continued blessings for the members of the, at your college. This is a great testimony after everything has gone. So, please thank you. Please, while these students are moving to the next step of their life, let them come to the very tutorial for them. Oh my, six good years. Good afternoon, the director, the principal, vice principal, teachers, students, and the team ladies and gentlemen. We're very happy to be here today and thank you all the challenges that we face throughout this year. We are immensely grateful to God for His mercy, His grace, and eternal love. We thank Him for supporting us, our parents, and the school. We appreciate Him for good health guidance and protection because we know that we would not be here today if not for him. I'd like to appreciate our family members for the love and support in all of our activities throughout these six years. We would like to thank the director for following through with her vision for this precious school. We know she has poured a huge amount of dedication and love into this school. So thank you very much, Ma'am. We'd like to thank the principal of the Bill College, Mr. Abadine, for effectively managing the school and maintaining the high standard of the Bill College. Thank you, Mr. We would like to thank Mr. Olatunji, the vice principal, for adequately preparing us for leadership roles. And we would like to thank Mr. Abadine for creating a smooth path for us to work to success in our foundation. We appreciate the captain for his abundance in prayer and his advice in the way of the Lord. We'd like to thank Mrs. Adebogu and Mrs. Adelaide for their love and support and especially for their mentorship. We appreciate the teachers who have helped us in our journey. Mrs. Eiyato, Mr. Okani, Mr. Biachi, Mr. Adeniji, Mr. Dayo, Mr. Billy, Ms. Bisola, and every other impactful teacher. I'd like to give special thanks to Mrs. Urukoto for her love, support, correction during classes, and for being our all around best English language teacher.
While the bar was busy having rock pop food in Boyd, I seriously enjoyed conversations with Kofu, Shilore, Motele, Tuntu, Dubai, Ashesla, and Zinab, even our life experiences. <laughs> I went to this table of the court. I'm proving my word as a good defensive striker. <laughs> and I, I, I do not feel like that. Right. 
kids. So whenever I'll be testing something, everybody says kids. Well, we have to raise our glasses for a while. Yeah, are you mastering your class? Cheers to the celebration of six years. Cheers to the bill for the Cheers to the staff. Cheers to our family. Cheers to the deck. Cheers to the board and the board. Thank you. 
I wish to call on the head of school for the head of school to come forward now to give the following award. Now, that the donor is Ajenko Oroye Odi, who was the head boy here 2004 to 05. And that prize is for the best student in government. Yesterday for Deborah Ferry. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Billy. Have your seat. Sir, Barista Bemi, Paul Bemi, Jai, 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 Mo, can you come forward for the next award, please? Thank you. That is the Justice Yariba Prize for the best children in English language. That is Mubara Tilola. We also have the Justice Jerima Prize for the best you know in Yoruba, Wuraola Bashir. Again, another just German prize for the best in literature. Here today, Debola Next we have the Dako Oni Prize. Dako Oni was the head boy. Oh, wow. He has 20 That prize is for the best students in the best students. That is Titi Friday, Josephine. Josephine, Titi Friday. Best students in Asta. Again, the only surprise for the best in mathematics, Titilola Ibarra. This is Chief Bola Ibi Prize. Chief Bola Ibi Prize for the best of growth students in social science. Okay, ma'am. Okay. The Chief Bola Ibi Prize goes to Allah being paid in Kulu as the best in the social science class. Best in the social science class. Now, I'll call on, I'll ask the director to please to remain to give the award for Pastor Femi of Monty Basel for the best in Christian religious studies. That is yesterday for the Abola. Best in Christian religious studies. That is yesterday for the Abola. There's another prize by Pastor Femi Oponsiba for the overall best children, and that is Titi Lola Mubara. Overall best children, Titi Lola Mubara. Congratulations.
Well, we shall ask the director to please stand in for Mrs. Irene Oshimolu since so she has left. So, we have Mrs. Irene Oshimolu's prize for the neatest graduating student, and that is for Ladele Omoyukoyega. <laughs> neatest graduating student. That is for Ladele Omoyukoyega. And 
Their word is for the pillar of peace and altruism. And it goes to Olajele Omoboyega.
Good afternoon, everyone. I want to thank the sporting, Ms. Ola Dineji, Ms. Ajayoba, Mr. Kamala, for giving me the opportunity to be commandant of the Red Cross Society. And then um, I want to present these items to, on behalf of the Red Cross Society and the graduating students of the set of 2019 slash 2020 to this room. Thank you very much. We are receiving this because it shows very well that you appreciate the school and you appreciate that society. We believe you will represent that society when you have left the school. God bless you. Thank you very much. I was built to be the best, number one and nothing less. Lead me to my destiny I have waited patiently I have vision, though I believe I know I can count on me So stand up for the champions For the champions, stand up Stand up, stand up For the champions, for the champions Stand up for the champions Just life, that's how it is Cause we have our...